The real reason your ex comes back. Your ex stopped talking to you. You didn't hear from them for a while. And then one day they messaged you on social media or they called you on the phone. And you may wonder why. Why did they decide to come back now? After they were gone all of that time. You may think they just got bored. And while that may have something to do with it, there's something else going on behind the scenes. Something that you may not be aware of. When your ex comes back, it's often because they try to replace you with someone else. But they made a wrong judgment about that person's value. They thought that person was more valuable than you are. But now they've realized that they made the wrong decision. So they come back to you. They message you unexpectedly. And they try to go back to how things used to be. As though they didn't leave you in a difficult situation. And they don't even talk about where they've been or why they left you. They don't even try to give you closure. Because they're very selfish. They're only concerned with their own interests and needs. So when your ex comes back, you should ignore them. Treat them how they treated you when you needed them the most. And I know it's easier said than done. They may seem more appealing and attractive after you haven't seen them for some time. And they may try to entice you. You may be looking for answers. You may want to be involved with them again. But you need to recognize that they left you because they thought they could do better. After all of the effort you put in. After you listened to all of their problems. After you tried to help them. They still chose to leave. Because they took you for granted. They thought the grass was greener on the other side. But then they realized it was all a mirage. It was an illusion. And now this is their karma. They're getting what they deserve. After they invalidated you after they minimized everything you did for them. They ended up with someone who didn't treat them well. Someone who is just using them because they have very poor judgment. They couldn't even see the value of what they had with you. So how could they correctly judge the value of what they have with someone else? But they knew they made you happy. They knew they made you laugh and smile. So they think that they can come back whenever they want and pick up where they left off. Because they left you and you were left confused. You didn't understand what was happening, which they were aware of. Your ex knows you're hurt. They know you're crying yourself to sleep. They know you want answers. But they don't care about giving you answers because they're selfish. That's why they left you without any closure. 
That's why they disappeared without any notice. And they come back because they just see you as a fool. They know you care about them. They expect you to be at their beck and call. So they text you. They called you because they know you still love them. They know you still care. They knew that when they left you and they showed no mercy on you. They showed no remorse, but they know that it had an impact on you. They know that it affected you. So they know that they can come back whenever they choose to because they've already weakened you. They've left you with a gaping wound and it's going to take time for it to heal. So they know they can come back and pick up what they left off. But they're not coming back because they love or care for you. If that was the case, they wouldn't have left. They come back because they want to matter to someone. They come back to control you. Because they couldn't control the person they left you for. That person didn't care about them. They got rid of your ex, so your ex was left wounded just like you were. And then they remembered you again. They remembered that you cared. So they contact you. They come back like nothing happened. Because they just want someone to say that they care about them, that they love them. They're seeking validation because their ego has been bruised and now they're expecting you to kiss it better for them because they realize that they don't matter to anyone, but they matter to you. They meant something to you. You loved them. But even if you accept them back and you tell them you miss them and you want to make things better, they're going to distance themselves again because they never came back for you anyway. They just came back for your validation. And once you've given it to them, they don't need you. They will go right back to chasing people who don't even care about them because that's what they really want. That's where they belong. You're just a pit stop, a service station. You're just someone who they know will always be there. Someone who will love them unconditionally. Someone who will accept their flaws, no matter what they've done to you. But they don't admire those qualities. They don't respect it. They see love as a weakness. They see it as something for them to exploit. Which is why you need to display strength. When your ex comes back, you need to ignore them. You need to block them. Let them be someone else's problem. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.